Yahweh Isis is the iron Counselor of the people So when I'm speaking in Hebrew I want to make it clear to you That I tried the tribulations What's beyond magic Now your past is one teach us to be passive being things where there's no profit because all of those lies that they done taught you about false Christianity it's not going to profit you you want to know what's going to profit you know who you want to know what's going to profit you I'm gonna show you go to go to Micah chapter 4 because I, I that's right Micah chapter 4 huh? okay that's cool because a lot of our people the moment they hear this truth, the moment they hear this word coming out, the first thought that comes into their mind is, what about the white man? What about this one? What about that one? And it's like, get yourself together first. But guess what? The most I got a plan. All right, you wanted to know your role? The most I got a plan. Watch this. The book of Micah, chapter four, you get getting close to it. You get it closer. Chapter four, start from verse three. The book of Micah, chapter four and three. And he shall judge among many people. So when Christ comes back, he's going to judge many people. He's going to judge my nation, all right? He's going to judge your nation. Read on. And rebuke strong nations afar off. He's going to rebuke strong nations afar off. Because the so-called white race that created all kind of weapons, nuclear weapons, all kind of stuff like that. So what he going to do? He going to rebuke them from afar off. Read on. And they shall beat their swords into plowshares. And guess what? Christ is going to make y'all uh, beat, beat all your swords to plowshares. Meaning y'all going to get rid of all your weapons of mass destruction. Read on. And their spears into brewing hooks. Read on. Nations shall not lift up a sword against nations. Now read verse 2. And many nations shall come uh -huh. and say, Come and let us go up to the mountain of the Lord. So now many nations are going to come and say, let us go to the mountain of the Lord. Why? Because like we read earlier, you're going to realize your fathers have inherited lies. Read on. And to the house of the God of Jacob. And you're going to have to go to the house of Jacob. Meaning you're going to have to come to us, the true Hebrew Israelites. Read on. And he will teach us of his ways. And he will teach us of his ways. Meaning we, the true Hebrew Israelites, is going to teach you the will of the Most High. The Most High God, true will. Yahweh our power, by Hashem Yahweh Shah, who is God in the name of Jesus Christ. That's how you're going to learn the true will of the Father. Go to Isaiah 14 and um, 2. Let's find out what else is going to happen with these other nations. Because there's an order being established. The Most High is taking the humble and the meek, the ones who've been the lowest of the earth, and rising them up to the top to be the real kings and queens of the earth. You so-called black man, blacks, Hispanics, indigenous people, you are the children of God. You're supposed to be up here teaching all of the Gentiles God's true will according to the Holy Bible. But instead, you're up there following it. Huh? I think everybody is God's children. Nah, everybody's not God's children. Everybody's not God's I children. I think people chosen. I think mean, they're chosen. Okay. People that God shows favor to, but I think everybody is a child of God. Okay. So the children of Israel are God's chosen people. The light and only people. Uh, in order for that to happen, the other people that are not Israelites, in order for them to be declared in that fashion, this is what they got to follow. Read that. It says in Isaiah chapter 14 and 2, and the people shall take them. So it's saying the people, meaning other nations, they're going to take them. Who is the them? That's the Israelites. Read on. And bring them to their place. And bring them to their place, meaning they're going to say, yo, you're the real Israelites. Do you realize you're the real Israelites? That's why I said, look, if you really want to play your role, then go ahead and tell the people the truth then. Read on. And the house of Israel shall possess them. And the house of Israel shall what? Possess them. The house of Israel going to do what? Possess them. You know what it means to possess something? To own them. You understand? So now, guess what? We are going to possess the same people who's going to wake up to this knowledge and realize, yo, we ain't the real Jews. They are the real Jews. Let's bring them back to their homeland. Not that false prophecy that they tried to fulfill in 1942 or 41 with the fake Jews. Read on. In the land of the Lord, your servants 
and handmaids. And it said we're going to possess you for servants and handmaids. Meaning that there's an order that you got to submit to. Because now go to Luke chapter 19 verse 27. So the order that you got to submit to in order to be a child of God, you have to acknowledge that, look, the Israelites is going to be the ruling class of the new world to come. Okay, but I, I, I'm not disagreeing with that. I just think that everybody is a child of God. And, uh, so are you trying to and, uh, and all I'm saying that, if, if or everybody's not a child of God, I'm, I'm going to show you why. Go to St. John chapter 1 verse 10. So you believe you're a child of God? I'm not saying that you, I don't know. I don't know your life. I don't know what you live in. So I'm not judging y'all. Okay. can't say that you are. Let, 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 let me ask you a question. Let, let me ask you a question, right? If you're an alcoholic and a drug addict and a child molester, are you a child of God? <laughs> and and non-repentant, meaning that's just what you love to do. That's what you want to do. Okay. Do you plan on do you plan on getting off of drugs? So then you need to start now. You need to start now. That's what you need to do. Yeah, well I the I am he got the street fire. FBI, they be having my phone tap. Look outside, CIA, they got my home tap. I keep it so real, y'all got to feel me. Y'all the conspiracy theory, man, they got to kill me. Y'all were ISIS, I am counselor of the people. So when I'm speaking in Hebrew, I want to make it sense.